Hello guys, this is Vinny Burgess from Zao Security and I welcome you to another video tutorial from our ethical hacking video series. In this tutorial, I'm gonna talk about Nmap. So we'll be covering up all basic aspects of Nmap here. Before that, we'll just discuss what is exactly Nmap. So Nmap is a short form for network mapper. It is an open source security tool which is used for network exploration, security, scanning and auditing. According to me, nmap command comes with a lot of options that can make the utility more robust and difficult to follow for the new users like you. But with this tutorial, I'm gonna make the nmap an easy experience for you guys. So let's start up the nmap basic by just hitting up the terminal here. So the first and the most simplest nmap command is nmap and the IP address that we are gonna scan. So what I just did is just I just type nmap and just an IP address of the host which I'm gonna scan. So this is the most basic nmap command. So we'll just hit enter and see what other results we got. That was a quick scan. It just took 0 0.40 it's 42 seconds and it says the host is up. We also got the information about the MAC address of the machine. So here are the open port results we've got here. We got interesting things here which is 21 is FTP, 22 SSH. So with this simple nmap command which I just typed here, which is nmap without any query and the host IP address we got this information. So getting down to the next basic nmap command is the simple ping scan. So what is the basic simple ping scan in nmap? The basic simple ping scan is we'll just hit and map and use tag s simple p for ping and type the host pardon, 124.129. So what this command will just do is just it will just send a ping request probe to this given host and if the host replies back to our ping probes it means the host is up and if it doesn't then the host is down so we'll just check that by hitting up this command and we'll see exactly if the host is up or not so as the nmap says the host is up and the MAC address is this and it just took 0 0.11 milliseconds to complete this task so if you further elaborate this command we can use this basic command of a simple ping scan to discover a whole network so we can map out a whole network and we can see how many hosts are there in the network and how many are up so we'll just use the same command with just a little bit tweaking at the end so what we'll do we'll just add up 0 forward slash 24 so what we're going to do in this particular command is we are going to search for the whole subnet using the ping command so what it will do it will just ping all the hosts and if the host replies back so it will say the host is up and we'll get a whole idea of what kind of network we're working on so we'll just hit enter and see what we got here it just six some time we'll just wait and see what are the results okay the nmap scan is being done so we got a whole bunch of information here the nmap scan report for 74.1 says the host is up dot 2 says the host is up what so dot 29 host is up dot 28 host is up and 254 the host is up so what this command simple command did it just showed us whatever hosts which are running on this network are replying to our connection probes so this is a basic command which is used by pen testers to look how many hosts are up around them so they can test further our basic next command would be the nmap range command in that command i will just hit enter before typing um, 192.168 or 174.0-200 so in this particular command which is the nmap range scan what it will do it will just search for a particular range of hosts you can also tweak in your range you can use 25 to 50 to see that from 25 to 50 IP addresses all the hosts are up or not so, but we will just use 0 to 200 to see any IP addresses between 0 to 200 which are up or not so we just hit enter 
so we got a bunch of results here so what we did was and map and we scanned for a particular range which is from 0 to 200 and we got a bunch of good information so this is dot 1 and we got 3 open ports here this is 2, this is 2, 28 so these are the holes which are up and these are the results we got here our next command would be the OS detection command so what we will do is in map that O so in this command you just try to detect what kind of OS has been running over the host. So in this command I'm just typing that what OS is dot one twenty nine host running up. So you just hit enter and see. So as you can see we got the whole in map report here and the OS detection was performed and the OS details are here which says it's running Linux 2.6 kernel. So this basic nmap command showed us the information about what kind of operating system is being run over on this host. So this was the part 1 for nmap basic. I will continue with part 2. You can find it over here with this video tutorial series playlist. Also by that time please go to our website and you can go to our training part you can find all the videos security training videos over here and you can also go to our blog which is a bit interesting one you can have a look and you can also like us on facebook to follow our video tutorial series updates so that's all for now uh, we'll catch you up on part 2 of nmap basics thank you